Welcome back to another episode of Coffee Time Podcast, episode 9. I really cannot believe that I'm at episode 9. Can you guys believe it? Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, I'm the creator of Coffee Time um, Podcast, and I'm the host of Coffee, um, Coffee Time Podcast, and I'm the creator alongside with my lovely wife, um, the we we both are the creators of our first podcast, and it's called First Time Parents Podcast. And the link will be down in the description below. It's only eight episodes. Please, the playlist will be uh, in the description below. Please go check that out. Um, how you guys' day has been? Um, I know you guys are wondering why am I in a suit. Um, I just came back from church. Um past past couple days past four days it's been a very very powerful very powerful um, we had a South Eastern conference so um, was you know uh, a very very powerful time um you know I want to into you know some of you guys don't know me who I am um, my name is Lee Cruz I'm 25 years old. Um, I'm a father of a one, of of one, of a one year old. I'm the husband of Desiree Cruz. I'm my uncle. Uh, I'm a brother. I'm a son. I'm a minister. Minister um, of the of the gospel. I'm not an ordained minister. I'm a minister of the gospel. Um, I'm a drummer, as you guys know. I'm a drummer. I'm, I'm as you guys can see. I'm a um, church boy. I raised up in the church. But um, but I'm from. I'm not from South Carolina. I'm from the Bronx. I'm from the Bronx. And, and, uh, you know, I wanted to talk to you guys about the funny things that, that happened in New York, in New York City. So, uh, I do, I do miss, I do miss, um, New York, but, um, I do, I do miss it because everything was so close. Everything is close. It's nearby. And I just want to... You know, one day I'm gonna go back and visit. I'm gonna go back and visit. But um, the funny things that that I've witnessed was was I believe I was the one that was doing the funniest things. I was because I'm um, back in high school. In high school, I did the most the funniest things. So um, I believe at the time in school. Uh, where I used to, um, used to go to school at, it closed down. Um, it's called the New Life School. Back in school, we um, we love. I love playing basketball, as you guys know. I love playing basketball. Um, I, I've, you know, a little rusty, but I'm, you know, been in the lab and getting. The lab means like getting my shots in. Meaning, um, you know, we had split the gym, um, split the lunchroom up into a gym. It had, uh, like, sometimes we have full courts, a full court. Um, one hoop, one hoop on this side, and the next hoop on the cross. So, um, we pick the teams before, you know, before we go to lunch. Okay, we pick the teams before we go to lunch. And my main man, David, still, still, um, still one of my bestest friends to this day. Um, and, you know, we had rivals 
basketball players. You know, one one game we win, next game we lose. Next game we win, next game we lose. But other than that, so I had a teammate that likes to ball hog. Have you ever heard of, um, please comment down below, um, if you ha ever had a teammate that ball hogged the ball every every chance that he get the ball. So I got mad and I got mad and upset. I got mad and upset and you know I'm like I'm open, I'm open, I'm open. And he he didn't hear me. So the funny thing I did was I blocked my own teammate. <laughs> I blocked my own teammate. And then he was like, we're on the same team. I'm like, I do not care. You freaking ball hog. I didn't, I didn't say freaking. I said, you know, the other word. I'm like, I don't freaking care. Pass the, pass the ball. So I had everybody rolling. I had everybody rolling in the gym. And it was... The... The main topic of the whole entire day. My, uh, David, David to this day be like, bro, you remember when he calls me? He's like, bro, do you remember when you, uh, blocked, uh, blocked J-Day? I'm like, oh yeah. He was rolling on the floor. When I mean rolling, er, like the whole entire gym the whole entire gym went quiet and started busting out laughing after I did that. Um, we we uh, had a lot a lot of fun, a lot of funny things happen. Um, the funniest uh, I um I can uh, another funniest thing is when uh, back in high school, like everything, <laughs> everything like I can laugh about it now because. I've seen it. I've witnessed it. Um, I laughed about it. Uh, um, at the time, I was dating my ex. My uh, my ex-girlfriend at the time. And the funniest thing that she would do is she falls down the stairs. <laughs> I know. I'm, I'm sorry. I know it's not, uh, it, it's not funny. But every chance she get, like, she falls. She fell. She falls down the stairs. I remember it was the fire drill. You know, it was the fire drill. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. She falls down the stairs. Wow. Oh. While she. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. While she was going down the stairs. And she ended up falling on her face. And she gets mad at me for laughing. And I was like... Like... To be honest with you, I'm like, you loved... Like, I was... um This was, uh like, I was telling her at the time while we were dating. I was like, you love the floor more than you love me. <laughs> she got mad for laughing. And she just speaks to me for the whole entire day. I'm like, I don't care. I'm still going to do me. I'm still going to do me. I'm like, you can be mad. And I'm and I'm like, uh, that's, that. you know, that was your karma. Because you got mad at me. Because everybody started laughing. Everybody started laughing. And I tried to help her up. She was like, do not touch me. Don't touch me. I'm like, forget it. I'm like, you don't want my help? Forget it. You don't have to get my help. And so that was the funniest thing. Um, the funniest thing is, uh, another funniest thing was, uh, I had, uh, you know, every, like these are like um, childhood stories from, uh, not childhood. This is like, um, you know, funniest things that I've seen, but mostly, mostly this, 
is is what I've seen in high school. Um, everything like in high school, everything was f was funny to me because it's like as I got older and I think about what I really went through in back in high school and to now, and I see I'm like okay God, I see what you're doing because. This is like, I have, you know, like, I have to be that example for somebody that's going through the, that went through the same thing that I went through in high school. Um, so, at, at the end of the day, I'm still gonna be me. I'm still gonna be me. I'm still going to be, uh, cordial. I'm still gonna be as funny I'm still gonna be inspiring I'm still gonna be I'm still gonna be me okay but um, other than that other than that I had uh, you know go going back down memory lane it's been uh, you know thinking of my, my friends my family you know the funny things that we've done in high school but, um, you know, we've went through, we've been through a lot. Yes, sometimes we, we argue. Um, the fact that, you know, the two people out of our friend group is fathers now. I'm a father. My other friend is a father now to, to a, a beautiful baby girl. Um, and... I'm a father to my handsome prince, LJ, as you guys know. But other than that, uh, other than that, the, that, that was um, the three funniest things that I've seen uh, in New York. And um, I hope you guys enjoy this, epi this episode. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And please give me some new topics to touch upon, okay? And um, for the this is um, for the finale. Next week will be the finale, okay? Next week, Saturday, will be the finale of Coffee Time Podcast, episode ten. I cannot believe I've made it to episodes to. 10 episodes so um, stay tuned for that and let's let's um, let's you know um, let blow up this video blow up this episode and blow it up and I'll see you guys in the next episode alright love you